cracked eggs over our heads. She may have thought we were crazy. As you can see, she's eager to learn and actually volunteered to MC the first half of the show. She will be sharing her interview speech tonight. Please welcome me. Please join me in welcoming the team. Hi, today I'm going to be sharing an interview of my uncle. His name is Chetan Karanak. He grew up in Goa, which is in India, and it's now a big tourist attraction. I chose my uncle because I'm very close to him, but there are things I'd still like to know about him. My uncle is a photographer, but I'd like to know what makes photography so special. He said that it lets me travel and I get to observe many things. It also it's also nice to study uh, st it's also nice to study shadow and angle. He's actually a banker, but his passion is photography. So that leads me to the ne my next question. Why didn't you pursue photography as a passion? I mean, as an occupation. He, his answer was, I'd love to, but you'd have to practice day and night, and that's something I'd prefer to do on the weekend or in my free time. My third question is, do you have any other hobby apart from photography? He said that he likes doing art and um, he likes doing art and playing the guitar. And in art, he likes to do caricatures. And during the uh, lockdown, he's been able to pursue both of them, especially playing the guitar. Did you know that he had a guitar since 10 years and only started using it in the lockdown? Mm -hmm. And my last question is, how was your childhood like in Goa since now it's a big tourist attraction? He said that uh, when he was little, he and his friends used to swim in the ocean and play cricket in the uh, lanes. Thank you. All right, VT, way to go, honey. Um, you joined us the very latest in class and yet still emceed half of the final presentation night. So I have to tell you, number one, I'm so impressed with your character and your courage. I think you're very extraordinary. Not many people do things like that. Um, and I loved that you stepped up and you did a great job also. Um, you're a good speaker, VT. Your voice is excellent for speaking. It's nice and clear. It's easy to listen to. Uh, a couple times you stumbled, but the thing is, is you kept going. You didn't let it fluster you, and that happens to everyone. Everybody stumbles, uh, and you did the best thing that you can do. You just kept going. You didn't, uh, you didn't let it hold you back. Um, you have an expressive face. I would like to see you use a little bit more expression in your face. And again, you joined us late, so you didn't have as much training as everybody else. I still feel like you did a great job. I'm really glad you joined us. I feel like you added a lot to the class. You have a good sense of humor, you're fun, you're engaging, and I think you should feel proud of the work that you did in Head Start this year. I hope you do, and I hope you have a great summer. Take care.